and welcome to our society, which buzzes 24-7. People are always connected, whether traveling, working, eating, drinking, even sleeping, and you're one of them. Constantly on the move and never wanting to miss out. But are you going too fast? Being aware is key. Find out how you are doing by answering these questions. When driving, do you struggle to keep your eyes open, blink, start yawning, or open a window for fresh air? When talking or listening, do you ever lose track of a conversation, miss details, or forget what you are trying to say? When working, do you take more risks to finish a job quickly, or do not take the time to get the right tools? If you have answered yes to some of these questions, it is likely you are tired, unfocused, and fatigued. Fatigue is often a cause or contributing factor in incidents and accidents across the world. Being aware of the signs is the first thing that we lose. This is your wake-up call. We are here to help. First, know what it is, and then recognize the signs. What is fatigue? Fatigue is defined as lack of mental alertness or drowsiness arising from the lack of sleep. How can we stay alert? Get plenty of good quality sleep. That's the only way. It's not rocket science, and these three simple steps can help you. Start with awareness. Recognize if you are fatigued. Do you often yawn or blink your eyes? Are you grumpy or irritated? Do you feel impatient? Are you taking more risks? Do you have difficulty focusing? Do you miss details? Second, understand it is all about getting the sleep you need. On average, we need seven to nine hours of sleep per day. But remember, we are all different. Think of how many hours you sleep on average during your holidays without the alarm waking you. Keep in mind, sleep is not the time you spend in bed. Protect your sleep and get it. Third, it is also about quality sleep. Sleep recovers the body and brain. Good sleep helps you learn and gets creative juices flowing. A fixed bedtime and a routine can help. Have a warm drink, take a shower, brush your teeth, read a book, and you're off to have sweet dreams. Make sure you sleep in a dark, cool, quiet, and comfortable bedroom. Get rid of all distractions. Keep all screens out of the bedroom and clear your head. But remember, we are all different. What works for you may not work for me. The fact is, sleep is one of life's essentials. Value your sleep.